The future of a bubble dome at a newly planned tennis facility burst tonight after a vote from city council members in Keller. And that is where we find our Jeff Paul live with what just happened a couple of minutes ago. Well, Kaylee, many uh, tennis fans and supporters of the Birch leave here tonight. Keller Town Hall very disappointed after hours of debate and back and forth and discussion on city council. There wasn't enough votes to get this amendment approved for those two larger bubble domes. Now, take a look. We probably have some video of these renderings. You can see what we're talking about. The tennis facility, which was already approved back in November, wanted to install two 43-foot-tall bubble domes for indoor tennis. Some residents near the site were worried it could hurt their home values and would be unsightly. And because there was so much opposition, tonight's vote required a supermajority, meaning six out of seven council members had to vote yes for it to pass. That number fell short by one vote, and tonight residents opposing the bubble dome say they feel validated. I couldn't be more pleased. I, I think it's uh, the best decision. I think they need to come back and start all over with a new plan. Now, we did try speaking with the Dent family tonight regarding the project. They're heading at former tennis pros. They declined to comment. No word on what will happen to the future of this project. But as it stands currently right now, it sounds like it's not going anywhere. Reporting live here.